What's up everybody, it's Andy Man from Team Tactical Gaming. I'm here to talk to you about the second Key Warden who's found in the Dulgar Oasis in Act 2 of Diablo 3. And uh, basically I'm just looking for him as well. And uh, you just gotta go around the map, you'll eventually bump into him and uh, if you kill him he should drop a key. I'm looking for the, uh, the second key, which is the key of hate, and the guy's name is Sokar. So uh, hopefully we'll, we'll bump into him here. Your chance is uh, flirting with my barbarian here. We always have fun chat. Um, yeah, so. Hopefully we find this guy pretty soon and I'll show you guys uh, the key of hate. Um, from my last video you guys uh, realize that um, I was telling you to make sure that you have Nephilim Valor on your character. You get that from killing large groups of enemies at a time, or by uh, killing elites, and you can you can increase your chances of magic find, which will increase the chances that the, the key warden is actually going to drop the key, <coughs> since it is a legendary item. So, definitely, if you can play this with the buddy, or have uh, you know m magic find items I know some guys will rock an extra ring something that has high magic find or you got a, you know a helmet or something that's got magic find try to wear it for this part uh, or even just put it on before you fight the key or and, uh, you're gonna have a, a great chance of, of getting the key I've done this a few times already and I, I, I created the infernal machine with the three keys and then I've actually gone into the unique realms that you can access with the Infernal Machine. And what you're looking for in there is you're looking for the demonic organs, which uh, you get one from each realm, and each realm is created by three keys. So you need, you need to get nine keys in total in order to do this. So you have to kind of farm these bosses. And, uh, no, I, had, I didn't have any no of the organs actually drop for, for me, so uh, that's kind of it's kind of frustrating. I, I'm hoping that this key or sorry this uh, ring is amazing because it's taken a lot of work. You have to beat the game. You have to play on Inferno mode, and uh, if, you, if you don't uh, you don't get it, you just gotta keep farming this guy, which. Which is kind of annoying because there are three different apps. Still recharging. The ingredients are a one-time thing. Once you find the the plan for it, um, you can you can just use it over and over again. So that's no big deal. And uh, and then once you, you just gotta get the keys, which which is the farming part. So let's do it here. You will not enter the aqueduct. And uh, sorry for the coffin, guys. I'm a little bit sick here, so just pay no mind. Come on, Sakaar. Well, let's go, buddy. Oh, here he is. He dropped the key. Yeah, he did. All right. So notice, guys. Like I have, I have uh, three Nephilim Valor 
on my character. I've got 29 minutes left, so I recommend that you go around and you want to you want to play the level a bit before you uh, encounter and attack the key warden because if he doesn't have uh, sorry if your character doesn't have that um, Nephilim Valor on him you're, you're probably not going to be able to get the key drop so if you bump into the key warden early maybe it's best to leave and uh, you know fight a few of the enemies on the map and then come back because as you can see I had like 29 minutes 28 minutes left on my my character for Nephilim Valor so there's the key of hate which is the second key that you can find in the game and it's in the Dulgur Oasis uh, the map will change every time so you know it, it may not be up in this corner again but uh, I, I usually I find they're kinda roughly in the same area each time so it's kinda top left corner of the map um, yeah and there it is the second key from the key wardens and I'll be posting the video for the third key right after this one guys I hope you enjoyed